Hey, so uh, I decided to redo the experiment over here where the soil is much better. Uh, see, it's, it's really soft and uh, easy to crumple with your hands. It's pretty dark. Over there where I was doing the experiment earlier, uh, the layer of soil was maybe this thick, and under that it was heavy clay and uh, puddles of water would form there, so the only kinds of things that really would grow there would be like rice, uh, radishes, and uh, things that can uh, handle saturated soil, but here we can grow a wide variety of uh, different things. So, this is, uh, <clears throat> so far we've done the plowing here, and then we're going to have the mulching, probably uh, over here. This is going to be the forest garden, this is going to be the permaculture, this is going to be the uh, organic style. And it's going to be traditional plowing style. See, here it's uh, it's more like the I managed to get it down to the, the fine rocky grit. And now, with the plowing, basically this is mainly a weed uh, destruction method, since many of the seeds that we have don't do don't compete well with weeds, though quite obviously in nature plants live alongside each other so the hardier plants or the ones with seeds that are closest to nature would still be able to grow in the forest garden however things like tomatoes and highly cultivated things would probably need to have this kind of starter bed uh, hopefully the main grain crop for this we'll, we'll be able to make buckwheat but uh, we'll still check it out alright